again so i think that it's subjective to the application um, building swapping infrastructure makes sense when you can build some sort of a standard uh, in the industry I mean, doesn't need to be a standard for everybody but at least the majority of the industry needs to adopt the standard um, and then it makes sense to have say batteries uh, inside swapping stations available um, for for replacement um, and that's possible in say two wheelers three wheelers some smaller mobility applications uh, and also probably financially viable given that their range is not going to be significant so you want to be able to frequently swap it out but if, if it's going to be for say a car or a bus um, not a very big fan of swapping in those applications uh, because each additional battery that is inside a swapping station costs much more money and typically the expectation would be that the batteries inside these vehicles can go a longer distance uh, it might make sense to have some sort of swapping infrastructure for buses with fixed routes so that's that's one option but i think that um, swapping probably will make most sense for two and three wheelers which is also the direction that india is sort of going in um, but for larger applications it's probably going to be charging infrastructure there is a double-edged sword, right? So there is fast charging capability which exists, but the faster you charge a battery, the faster the battery dies in terms of its life because you're putting more stress on it. And so it can't go just one way. So it's not just about faster charging and that's it. There needs to be faster charging with better battery management uh, that allows battery life to be preserved while the charge is being sort of delivered faster. Um, 